Good morning. Tuesday, the 22nd day of September 2020. I'm Vincent J. Russo with the Russo Law Group. A few months ago, John and George and I took a trip over to Alivard Street in Lido Beach. I've been living here for over 55 years. So let's uh, share that story. Are you guys ready to go? Hey, John, George, we're here at the Marvell, uh, a landmark, great soft ice cream. And when I was a little kid back in the 1960s, I would come here every night and I love the pistachio ice cream and the peanut butter ice cream. Just a great place. And uh, the great ice cream cone on top. And Marvell was established in 1951. I didn't realize uh, by the Papa George family that early. And next to it is the 19th hole. So the golfers across the way would cross this four lane highway, not this big six lane highway. And they would come over to the 19th hole for a drink after a long day of golf or scoot over here and get some ice cream. What fun. So here we are on the corner of Alibard Street. And we're looking at the Teresa Building, the Teresa Foundation for Children with Special Needs at 250 Lido Boulevard. There's our logo. And here is our firm office in Lido Beach. Now, what many people may not know is that back in the 1960s, this was King's Corner. And at King's Corner, uh, Dottie King, the owner, had a pizzeria, and uh, legend has it that Mick Jagger came to uh, this establishment for a slice of pizza on his way to the Hamptons. This was the first place I worked, uh, flipping pizzas. First one I made, I put it in the oven, and Mrs. King made me clean up the oven. Now we're gonna go down the block, heading down Alivard Street. What you may not know is that um, Lido Beach is a hamlet. Uh, so a hamlet is a settlement outside a village and inside a town. Uh, so um, as my family knows, just Google it. Meanwhile, this is a new build. Uh, it's a very nice house, uh, on the, but no living on the first floor since Hurricane Sandy and no building on the first floor. Um, and then we get to this last corner house. And uh, this may be a familiar sight when I get around to the other side. By the way, we have a very prestigious uh, retired politician who lives on this block, whose name I won't mention. Okay, um, getting to the front of this, uh, there was the movie Still Alice, heart-wrenching movie of Alice who had early onset Alzheimer's. This was the home used for the summer residents, and a good friend Addy uh, allowed them to build there. So this is the end of our trip. We have a dead end. We have the dunes, and there you have it. The infamous Alivard Street. Every street has a story. You just have to find out about it. And by the way, just a little hint. It wasn't filling the holes in Albert Hall, but filling the holes in the street as to who the politician is. And I know there's a street in Liverpool that's pretty famous as well. Penny Lane. Everyone have a great day and be safe.